Okay, so we're going to show you how to use the new ozone cupping system. Uh, we've got our patient here who doesn't have any reason for us to, to do this, but she's probably going to want to leave because she, <laughs> she's going to be difficult. Um, so basically all you're going to do is connect this to your ozone generator here. And then it's got a built-in destruct on the inside and the ozone will come down through the, through the middle and then we'll put it here and it will just sit there. And uh, the ozone that is not absorbed will exhaust up through these holes. There's a destruct on the inside. So we're gonna go ahead and turn our oxygen on. I'll probably do a fairly slow flow rate, like an eighth of a liter per minute or so. Turn my generator on. And I'll just hold the cup here. Depending on the situation and what you're trying to treat, maybe a minute, two minutes, could be more. Um, you might do, you know, five minutes. Um, it just really depends on what we're treating and how much ozone we want to get into that area. Um, so this is all there is to it. Now, if I press it firmly to the skin, it will, uh, it will pretty much seal on that and the excess ozone will come out of the top of the cup. You probably will get a little bit of ozone that'll sneak out around the bottom edges of the cup, um, depending on where you're treating on the body. So when you start to, if, you st if and when you start to smell ozone, um, in this general vicinity, um, you're probably going to want to wind down your treatment at that point in time if you're not able to get a good seal. Otherwise, you could sit here for, like I said, a, a longer period of time. Uh, that's pretty much all there is to it. Um, at the end of this treatment, we're in a fairly decent sized room, so I'm actually just going to turn my generator off at the end and I'll let my oxygen flow for a little bit longer. I might even turn the oxygen tank up to maybe like a half a liter per minute and force the ozone residual in that cup out through the through the top or the vast majority of it. So I'll probably sit here for another 30 seconds just holding it allowing that um, ozone to exhaust out the top and then if there's a little bit left in there and we take the cup off um, that's not a big deal at all totally fine.